This is a Horn Frogs team that led the nation in fast break points, also top 15 in the nation in sharing the sugar. They're in their road purples, the home whites for the number one team in the land, the Houston Cougars. Houston plays two bigs up front in Roberts and Francis. Top of the key three for Emmanuel Sharp. ESPN's exclusive presentation of college basketball is brought to you by Phillips 66, proud sponsor of Big 12 basketball. They're good talkers, they play hard, and they're outstanding in pick and roll. Here's Francis, five and white. Big to big passing. Roberts underneath has the first two for him. Double teamed in the post. Roberts gets it out. Sharp, aggressive in the early going. With six on the shot clock, the floater from LJ Cryer. Number one team in the land, up nine points, now make it 11 straight to start the game. Here's Trey Tennyson, nice bounce pass, and even a dunk attempt is challenged. Everything is challenged. But they're really long, like Javier Francis has a 7-5 wingspan. And not only does it make it tough around the rim, cut his hand, had to have stitches when they were playing in Oklahoma, but came back in that game, and he told me earlier he's good to go. Done for three. That's a huge plus for Kelvin Sampson. And even when you get Houston's defense to start to domino, when you get them in rotation, their closeout ability, their recovery is so good. And there's an easy slam from Javier Francis. Wilson, working on Wilson. Good dig by Jawan Roberts, turned it over. And here's Jamal Shedd in the player of the year, has his first two. Here's Jawan Roberts coming over, look at that. I mean, you don't even know he's coming, forces a turnover, and then you gotta come up with that loose ball. 10 on the clock. Roberts, another easy two. Jawan Roberts from Jamal Shedd. Shed. Ball movement, done, three. Damian Dunn's my personal project. We need him come tournament time. He's got six today. Here's Coles, no, Man. and the follow doesn't go, wow. twice. One on one, tough shot. Nice look. Shed finds Roberts. Stop me if you've heard this before. Have you ever seen one of those rebounding bubbles that coaches <laughs> put up? They're torture devices. <laughs> Seems like there's one on each rim today. And LJ Cryer says, this one's got to go down. It does. I also think there's something about winning the Leeds regular season and the tournament in the same year. Blocked by Houston. And ripped away by Jawan Roberts. With 10 on the shot clock. Coles, couple of shot fakes. Inside, O'Bannon, yes! And an and one opportunity. Javier Francis, three-year player. Like, they've had guys in this program. Last shot time for the Cougs. Good guy to take it, LJ Cryer. 43% from three in his last five. He's got his second triple of the game. Peavy, blocked by Francis. And those are the shots you have to hit against this defense. Wilson, unmolested, but he draws the foul and has an and one opportunity. Play a lot more. Malik Wilson, transfer from Texas Tech. And I think that's the, you know, what's the next level Houston? They want to use it again here in Kansas City. And there's the letter that Joe C. sent to Kelvin Sampson a decade ago. He says every time he's asked, the two best hires I ever made were Kellen Sampson and Lauren Sampson. Shed for three. They've won 20 or more. A TCU basketball program has never done that. What a feed from Shed to Francis. I mean, I don't know what Jacoby Coles is doing, but like Jamal Shed's a great player, but I, I think a 12 year old could have made that pass. Maybe not with the strength. <laughs> It was interesting, it did a game, Houston's game at... Wow. And that 
Emmanuel Miller. First bucket of the game. Tips that ball away. Look at Shed just fronting Miller. Two Houston guys after the loose ball. You save it under your own basket. And that gives Miller a chance to get his first points. He was so good yesterday. He's over 50% in his last four from three. Sharp pulls up and knocks it down. Beloved in the state of California and certainly the same way in Fort Worth where he played his college ball. Thrown away by Roberts. And blocked in defensive transition by Wilson. Wilson says no free lunches today. Up 21. Give me that. You got to earn everything against this. Ball's got to move. And, and it's you're going to have to make secondary passes, extra passes in order to do that. You can't turn it over. You've got to be able to hold your own in the glass. Now Shed with three to shoot. He does, and he cans it. And don't adjust your screens. Houston is in a zone. I would imagine it's because of the score. And Peavy takes it to the dish. He has 13 to lead the Frogs. Fort Sill in Lawton, Oklahoma. He invited uh, me and some soldiers down to see their teams. Hollis Price could really go, man. One minute left. A thoroughly suffocating, if not spectacular, performance by the number one team in the nation, the Houston Cougars. A 15-point win over TCU to advance to the Big 12 Championship semifinals. Your final score, 60-45. to 45.